You know those people that are double jointed? They can take their thumb and bring it down to the forearm. Or when they straighten their arm, it goes past 180 degrees. Or they used to be able to do party tricks where they could bring their leg behind their neck. Uh, those people are hypermobile. They're great gymnasts. It sets them up for being quite a good dancer, ice skater. But they're also more prone to ligamentous injuries. And one of the ligamentous injuries that can happen is at the shoulder. It can become loose. And what can occur after that is they can get rotator cuff injuries or they can get um, bicep injuries. They can get other injuries in the shoulder. But the underlying um, background behind the injury is a loose capsule. And the capsule is something that attaches around the whole shoulder. It allows, it's loose on the underside, back down here, so that allows you to bring that shoulder all the way above your head. It doesn't work well on the skeleton, but you, can, you get what I'm saying. There's a redundancy down below, and on occasion, that, that area gets stretched out. This also happens in throwing athletes, for example, tennis players and volleyball players, and anybody who uses their, their arm above their head. What I can tell you is that even if you have a rotator cuff injury, something right here, and it gets treated with surgery, you haven't treated the underlying cause. And this can be treated before surgery, after surgery, and maybe, depending on the other injury, instead of surgery. And can, prolotherapy or PRP can both be used to treat uh, uh, ligamentous laxity or capsular uh, laxity or hyper in, in hypermobile people. My name is Dr. Jennifer Stubbing and I'd love to be able to have a conversation with you and talk to you more about your injury. I can be reached at info at drstubbing.com or you can contact me through my website at drstubbing.com. I'm here to help you. Thanks.